forever. He just totally came in here for that. I wonder if he's ever going to show up again. That'd be too convenient, wouldn't it? I shouldn't be going backwards. Like I knew that was backwards. Yeah. 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 Make me think there's a second cat statue somewhere. The Cat Buddha. <laughs> oh, I just felt like doing that. Don't judge me. Oh, no treasures. Check my messages. Help! Help! Oh, please, you don't hurt me! Nope, you're gonna get spanked. Hey! Who that there? Your Who mama. else would scoff at the wrath of a rat? I your must mama. be a cat. Him no, cat. your mama. Everybody! Pick on Great somebody job, your guys. own size, why Great don't job. you? else Man, notice that good. my sword somehow magically set on fire to the hair tree and report to mayor Tulao. why you don't drop by for great pleasure to give us yes sounds good to me see you right soon gay so anyone else heard you drop by for great pleasure <laughs> you drop by for great pleasure Somebody's gone to be getting jiggy! Jiggy in the woods! Rockwall Canyon. Drop by for great pleasure. If you know what I mean. <laughs> oh, if you know what I mean. And I mean it again and again and again and again. And again. Until you can't again no more. Six cat statues. I couldn't even find it. I'll, I'll find those other ones at some other point in time. Where does this go? Booty. Oh, there's a shop. What oh, up, brother? You again. Always nice to see a familiar face in these troubled times. When I was here last time, this was a much nicer This health potion contains many rare and exotic herbs. Buy yourself a new heart container. Getting jiggy with it, getting, getting jiggy with it. Getting jiggy with it, getting, getting jiggy with it. Berserk Persian. Bottle of hornets. That sounds like the nastiest thing ever. A bottle of hornets. So why would you do that to anyone? That is like something you don't even wish on your worst enemies, no matter how much you don't like them. There's just things you don't do. A bottle of hornets is one of them. Oh, and that and well, this was my experience. But a friend of mine, some time ago, I was. 
I was talking about how hot his sister was. <laughs> and it was like he died. This magic <laughs> potion may taste like... It was like a part of him died on the inside. <laughs> it was hilarious. It was like his very soul rejected everything I ever had said at that point. It was like he wanted nothing more than to shut up and never talk again. That is the only way I could describe that. Oh snap, I need to get out of the water. I'm gonna drown. Ah, Galati, this reminds me a little bit of Wind Waker. How you could never really... You could never really swim for... You could only swim for X amount of time. And X amount of time wasn't always the longest time. Strange. The dragon statue is missing one eye. I saw someone like that today while I was out bowling. I went bowling early this morning. Bowled a horrible game, but yeah. Yeah. I was in it to win it. Like a champ. I was all over the place. I was like, oh yeah. Oh, here's another cat statue. Check that out. So what? Uh, I bet that it, it forms a little platform type scenario that lets me get to whatever that thing is. Chomza! Get to whatever that thing is suspended above. Double jumping for days. Well, I guess it's going to be an important area at some point during the game, so let us continue on to the next area. This is going to be a multiple part series with each recording. And I can't go that way. That is booty. That is booty. Save points. Just come up here wrecking people's stuff. Get wrecked. Yeah, it blocks off everything. So the only way inside. Oh, difficult camera angle. Yeah, I'm gonna have to activate all those statues to get whatever's up there. The magic passageways of magitude and sly rabbitness. What? You want something? Oh, snap. Air combat. Straight Marvel vs. Capcom Dragon Ball Z. So I was having a debate not too long ago about the next character they wanted to see in Super Smash Brothers. So I was sort of thinking like, move set wise, who, who, what do you guys, who do you think would make a good character? Like, a legitimately cool character to have. Oh crap! A legitimately cool character with a pretty decent moveset to have in Super Smash Bros. Who do you guys think would make a good choice? Because I I've been hearing a lot of ridiculous things. Like, I know they said every character is open. Sorry about that. Open to be chosen for Super Smash Bros. But some of them don't make any sense and having them would completely break the game. <laughs> Like some people were talking about, oh yeah, we, we put Goku in it. Why, why would Goku need to be in Super Smash Bros? 
or or somebody like Superman or Kratos or something like that. That's just that's just ridiculous. I, I was thinking more along the lines of cartoony characters, characters you ain't never seen before. Like I, I think either Sly Cooper or Ratchet and Clank would be a pretty good set of people to have inside of Smash Brothers. Either by themselves or together, however you want to put it. I think they are a really good choice to have in the games. I think they're a really good choice to have in the games themselves. What do you guys think? Ratchet and Clank for Brawl, yeah, or Sly Cooper. Better yet, any one of the, any, not any one of the Sly Cooper characters, but of the main three, well, main four, Sly, Carmelita Fox, Bentley, or Murray, I think they'd all be pretty good inside of Smash Bros. Mostly Sly. Because you know, yeah, Sly Cooper. Oh, speaking of Sly Cooper, what do you guys think of the next game? What do you think that's going to be about? Considering the way Thieves and Time ended, are they going to be showing any more of Sly's ancestors? Maybe any of the female Coopers in the part of the Cooper, Cooper, Cooper bloodline? I thought that that was a cool little thing they did with sharing his ancestors and that their abilities that they have left in the Thievius Raccoonus. Hey buddy, why are you running around in circles here? Ha! You're stumped, ain't ya? I'm practicing. If I manage to hop around the island 300 times in one day, I may eat these carrots. They're the best, juicy, firm, very delicious. That's what she said. <laughs> oh, seriously, I seriously don't do that. Stop. I I, I shouldn't be doing this because I'm probably gonna incur some wrath or something like that. Oh, if you hadn't noticed, I had, I purchased this game off of Steam, so my Steam overlay pops up every now so often to let me know what's going on. <laughs> Just doing a quick message check. So I was doing this thing on Skyrim over the last couple of days about being being that guy in Skyrim. What I did is I installed a bunch of ridiculous mods like the Naruto mod and a few armor sets and stuff like that. Have you seen Bebe? Ah, through your key! They told me about you. You'll find Bebe with our mayor, Too Lao. Just follow the way up and enter the open door. There he is. He always says, a mayor's door is to be open for all who need him. K is looking for his baby. <laughs> oh, gosh. Good afternoon. What's the big deal here? Yes, we're expecting the rat's attack at any moment. Mayor Too Lao is trembling with concern up in his house. For all we know, he's having a massive party. Plot devices, people. Plot devices. Ah, oh, can't go in their houses. Where can I find your mayor? What do you want from mayor? I am his best friend. We walk together every day. Certainly, he's in his house now. If you see him, remember me to him. Remember me to him. Shouldn't it be remember to mention me to him? I don't, I don't even know how to feel about that, bro. And these two are just characters in the background that serve no purpose other than to take up space. Who remembers the days when there was Maybe a lot of you NPCs know. like that? Me? Know anything? Guess why they call idiots hairbrained. See that face he's making right now? I'm making that face. Because that line... That line was wow, people. Wow. All right, let's get out of here. Let's let's keep this. Moving. 
I wasted enough time doing it. Hello, sir. Hello, my young fellow. You must be Kay, yes? Your reputation precedes you. Uh, uh, Bebe recounts endlessly how you defeated the rats and rescued him. I think maybe he exaggerated a bit. I hear you're after our friend, Cat. You got that right. It's personal. He closed my fighting school, trashed our village. Somebody's got to stand up to that scum sucking cheese breath. Just so. Undoubtedly, the same things you do to us. Batman. Our only hope <laughs> is some protection from the dragon, Torchy. Look, there's the entrance to the dragon's cave. But we cannot reach it anymore because the bridge is damaged. That bridge is wrecked. To get there, we have to solve the secret of the three dragon statues. But the rats inhibit us. We need the three rubies, the dragon's eyes. Legend says that the dragon will help those who solve the secret of the dragon statues. We had found all three rubies. But always, when we tried to activate one statue, our brave scout hairs got caught and the ruby was taken by the rats. You saved Baby, and he carried our last ruby. Just imagine what will happen when the rats enter the dragon's cave first. Their power would grow even larger. Their evil plans would come to fruition. I'll handle this. You can count on me. You have to, because they want to enchant Torchy with their evil magic, like what they have done with Borax. Torchy would be controlled by their will. He'd be turned against us and every other peace-loving peoples. No problem, Tulao. I'll convince Torchy that he should protect you guys from now on. You would do this for us? Yes, Not for I free. believe you will. Here is our last ruby. Yeah. Find the dragon torchy, activate six cat statues, blah 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 blah. Okay, I am now going to open the tree portals for you so you have access to all areas of the forest. Good luck. And the booty. Mostly the booty. Dude, you know what this reminds me of? That one episode, I believe it's either Family Guy or the Cleveland show. Where, sorry about that, where Cleveland. <laughs> Cleveland is in a get in a, in a. Hi, baby. I found some cat statues. What else can you tell me? When I sneaked out of the rat camp, I saw a crumbly part in the rocks hidden behind bamboo. Where Cleveland's in a band and it's like he's going on tour with somebody and when it switches to the cutaway, the cutaway scene, Cleveland is in like a unitard <laughs> with two other black guys and they're sitting there singing that song, Ooh. everybody, 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 everybody. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was one of the funniest scenes that I enjoyed from that series. Oh, that was a new one. Seriously? I 
I seriously just died? I seriously freaking died from that. I'm seriously feeling some other kind of way about that. That 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 is that is not only embarrassing but ridiculous. I'm upset by that. Screw this. Screw that little quest. And screw whatever it's supposed to give you. I ain't playing these games. Forget that noise. Peace. Forget a lot of ya. It's that magic well where all the water came from all year. You know what I want? You know what I want to see? I just want to see like a store that plays like the most intense dubstep. Like not just, just normal dubstep. I'm talking fusion dubstep. That's like combining multiple types of genres. Trance, jazz, soul. Just, just be all over the place with the music. And then at the very end there's a massive drop and then it rick rolls everyone. <laughs> uh, I saw this article where a DJ did that. Can't win it, <laughs> see one, freak. Wax to you, cat. Get him, boys. You must be Tack. Listen. Don't bother me, catnip, Wes. We're after that pesky dragon. I need six men or seven. No, no, six will do. I'm coming for you, you dirty rat. That is freaking sad, really. Get him, boys! I got something for yours. 